Okay guys, welcome to video number four. This time we're gonna look at how to connect this little guy right here. This is our push switch, okay? So that's the, the main goal of, of this particular video, okay? Um, so to start off, I'm just gonna disconnect my circuit. I'm gonna pull out the red one, the red wire. Just gonna leave that on the side. Oh, it likes to come back on me. Just gonna leave that on the side. Oh, it keeps like, like gonna come back. All right, uh, next thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna disconnect two of these LED lights just to simplify the circuit a little bit, okay? So I'm just gonna pull those two LED lights out, okay? You can certainly try to get the switch together with, um, with the LED lights in series or parallel. Um, that is also an interesting challenge as well. Okay, so what we're gonna do now is, let's just kind of maybe follow our electricity, okay? Electricity is coming from the black wire, okay? It's now going to this gray wire here, going through the resistor. From the resistor, it's going through the purple wire to the shorter leg of this LED, uh, line uh, number 20. And then it, it's gonna fall through to the longer leg that we had in 21. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna put this little um, switch here, right about there or so, okay? I'm gonna try to get a good overhead view so you guys can see how that's connected, okay? So all four of those legs, okay, the two front legs are connected there, the two back legs are connected there, okay? Now, there's a few ways that you can connect this now, okay, give that a good push down, okay, don't worry if you press the button, nothing's gonna happen. Um, so there's a few ways you can connect this. This is one way, is diagonally across, okay? So you can test this up by pushing the switch, Okay, you can see the lights coming on. So what that is actually doing is that the switch right now is stopping the electricity from moving. When we press the button, it's actually connecting diagonally from, uh, from number 21 on this side of the board across the switch to number 23 on the other side of the board, okay? And then that's going then back through that red wire and then finally back to the battery where it completes the circuit, okay? Another way that you can also connect this is to flip this over here to this side, okay? And again, I'm gonna press the button just to try it out and that does work, okay? So again, we know, I'm just gonna turn this over here, line number 21 is connected to that little top, I'm gonna to have to use a pen here. It's gonna be connected to that guy right there. Okay, from there, it goes through the switch. When you push on the switch, it connects this upper left dot to the lower, sorry, the upper right dot to the lower right dot, okay? And from there, it connects through the path in number 23, through the red wire, okay, and then back to uh, the battery, okay, which is now um, disconnected, okay? So uh, that's how that switch works, okay? So you can connect it from the same side. You can actually even connect it from these two sides right here as well, okay? Um, so you, we can actually do something like this. I'm gonna bring this over here. I'm gonna grab one more wire, and I'm gonna, well, actually, no. Um, well, that, that, it actually is connected through the side already. It's, it's already connected diagonally, okay? Um, all right, guys, um, that is it. You can certainly experiment a little bit more with how that switch works, okay? And uh, good luck to you, and see if you can also maybe get that working in series as well with three LED lights. All right, guys, see you next time. Bye-bye.